so hello guys in the third video of Jenkins playlist series I'm going to show you how you can use free styles in Jenkins so for that your first requirement should be you should have a EC2 instance launched and along with that you have to install Jenkins over it if you don't know how to install Jenkins on your server please watch my previous video on the same playlist you will get to know how to do it along with that so let's start so this is my Jenkins dashboard here I'm going to the dashboard for that so you can see here this is my code this is my public repository so that I'm going to bring onto Jenkins server using Jenkins free style pipelines okay so this is the this is the repo which we are going to use to uh, pull the code onto the Jenkins server. So I'm going here go to new items Click on that and here you can name it freestyle demo Okay, I have chosen this time this freestyle project. Just click on that and wait a moment so here this is the our projects portal now you can see here like there are so many options you can discard old build alike uh, so over time you will run again and again so it will create a huge list of builds so you can uh, for how much time you want to keep it and how much number of uh, build you want to keep it so I have just given there are multiple options like if you have some parameterized project then you will click on that and you will provide a values along with that uh, here this is the main thing which we are going to perform here this is git repo and here we have to provide the URL of the git just copy this go to your pipeline and paste it so see if it was a private repo then it will throw error here okay so for that you have to provide adding you have to add a credential here in this section you can see you have to provide the username you have to provide the password and just hit to add okay but in my case i am using uh this public repo so i don't need these things okay so this is done so here you have to specify in which branch you are running the code so for me for my case you can see here this is a master okay so this is done so along with that there are multiple important options so many important options like you can see here github hook trigger so if you will check it once you will update anything in the github so your code will be automatically built here no need to run okay so currently i'm not going with that just click on apply and just click on save so let's build this project so this is the one i was talking you will get if you will run multiple times so this is succeed so you see in the pipe pipeline way you will go declarative way so you will get a very uh, basic here a uh, visual something okay attractive but here you don't you, you don't have anything so here you can see this is success so how we will check in the last video i have discussed so there is a path you have to go okay so i think my vm got disconnected let me connect and come back to you i have started ubuntu so what will the path cd slash var sorry slash slip slash jenkins slash work workbook workspace okay hit enter ls see you can see your freestyle demo project is there just get into that so we can see here like in the freestyle way we have got all the code from git repo to the jenkins server so okay thanks for watching let's see you in the next video